If your vehicle is equipped with heated seats, the controls for each front seat are located near the bottom center of the instrument panel. On vehicles equipped with rear heated seats, the seats closest to the doors are heated and the controls are located on the rear of the center console. After turning on the ignition, press the switch once to select high level heating. When the high level setting is selected, the heater will provide a boosted heat level during the first four minutes of operation. Then, the heat output will drop to the normal high level. The system will automatically switch to low level heating after 55 minutes of continuous operation. At that time, the number of indicators illuminated changes from 2 to 1, indicating the change. Press the switch a second time to select low level heating. Operation on the low setting also turns off automatically after 45 minutes. Press the switch a third time to shut off the heating elements. And this is a, well, cool feature. Your vehicle may be equipped with front ventilated seats. Located in the seat cushion and seat back are small fans that draw the air from around the occupant and exhaust it underneath the seat and into the passenger compartment. The fans draw this air across the surface of the seat using air ducts and find perforations in the covering to help keep you cooler in warmer temperatures. The ventilated seat switches are located in the switch bank in the center stack of the instrument panel, just below the climate controls. The fans operate at two speeds, high and low. Press the switch once to choose high. Both lights will be illuminated. Press it a second time to choose low. When low speed is selected, one light will be illuminated. Pressing the switch a third time will turn the ventilated seat off. Please refer to the Owner's Information DVD for complete details and other important safety information.